Brian here with HelpSellMyRV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm going to do a walk around on this beautiful 2003 Newmar Mountain Air 39 SD TS Triple Slide Luxury Fifth Wheel. Overall, the fifth wheel is 39 feet 11 inches and weighs just a little bit over 16,000 pounds. Go ahead and get started on the outside, show you all the features, and then finish up this video by showing you the inside. This is a true Four Seasons fifth wheel. This is definitely one of the nicest fifth wheels you could have found in 2003. Uh, retail sticker was almost, uh, it was uh, just a little bit over $99,000 in 2003. Okay, does have the full body paint uh, finish, gel coat finish. You do have the beautiful front molded fiberglass painted cap. There are no decals on this coach. Beautiful full body paint gel coat. Definitely uh, rare to see on a 2003. The owners have this thing loaded up, so I'm not going to be able to show you the storage. But uh, you do have heated compartment areas here. Uh, this is a full Four Seasons camper, so your underbelly is fully enclosed. So all your holding tanks, all your gate valves are all protected from the elements. This is definitely sub zero degree. Uh, uh, rated camper. These new Mars are awesome. Uh, tons of storage. I'm going to try to keep this video under 15 minutes, so I'm not going to show you absolutely every storage space. It's fully loaded. This does have the dual furnaces, one uh, exhaust here, and I'll show you the exhaust on the back side. As I said, this weighs 6,000 pounds, 16,000 pounds dry, uh, so you do need the 10,000 pound axles. They're not 8,000. 10,000 pound heavy duty axles, tandem axles with uh, dual wheels. So this coach does have eight wheels, eight tires sitting on the ground, and all the tires are brand new. Let me show you the, the date, manufacturing date of the tire right there all the tires are the were made the 14th week of 2015 and that includes the spare tire up underneath also it's brand new and all the tires are in excellent condition you can even see the little stubbies uh, I think the owner says the tires only have about 200 miles on them more storage space there is your refrigerator exhaust See, they've even painted the access covers. Let's see if I can get a shot of this premium paint package that uh, Newmar does. Same paint, uh, as far as detail, that Newmar did on this coach is the same that they'll put on a Newmar Dutch Star or Mountaineer motorhome. Same paint job you'll find on a $300,000 motorhome. Pretty much these uh, Mountaineer fifth wheels came off uh, definitely the, the, the same uh, warehouse or factory came off the same line pretty much. You do have a, it's a large 20, I believe they're calling it a 20 foot awning. All your fabrics are in excellent condition. It is the cloth, it's not the vinyl awning. This is high end, definitely. It does have the metal shroud to protect your awnings. You do have a slide out awning package and you do have the shroud to protect your awnings. And they're the cloth too. The cloth are what you'll find in really high-end uh, campers and motorhomes. Beautiful rear molded fiberglass cap. I do want to point out the whole coach all the way around has dual pane windows. As I said, this is a Four Seasons coach. I do check all dual pane windows for foggy windows where the seals broke. Uh, and this one window here this is a ventilation window. It, I guess the seal cracked on it and uh, or busted on it and so moisture got in and made the window foggy. Uh, that is the only window that's foggy. So, you do have a ladder to get up to your uh, full walk-on roof. Uh, you do have two upgraded uh, 15,000 Penguin low profile AC units on the coach. You won't be able to see them if I back up. I'd have to get up top, but you know, let's see if I can show you here real quick. And, yeah, they're low profile, but uh, standard came with the 13,500 BTU up in the front. 
and a 15 in the rear, uh, but now they're two low profile 15,000 BTU AC units and they were just put on uh, two years ago. You have the full window awning package, again with the cloth. Everything's in excellent condition. You have the metal shroud to protect your awnings from snow and UV damage. And again, you do have a slide out awning package over the, that's gonna be the kitchen slide out and, uh, and, and table and chair area, which I'll show you when I get inside. 50 amp service, uh, all your uh, hookups are right here. Uh, and more storage, more storage. They do keep the wheels covered. Again, new tires all the way around. Nice scare light. I do point out everything. If I see a scratch or anything, I'll point it out. Uh, this is pretty much the only damage I, I noticed on the outside. And the owner's not sure how it happened. They think uh, somebody with a lawnmower might have clipped it. But anyway, I do point out everything. This is just the skirting. so. Uh, there's no issues with water coming in. See? Anyway, I do point out everything. I find it important. Second furnace. Uh, I'm going to show you your wet works area here, your hookups. This is a full Four Seasons camper, so all your gate valves or dump valves are all enclosed in, in the heated compartment area where the holding tanks are. Looks like they got a water pressure regulator here. Black tank sewer flush right there, hoses out your toilet tank. I'm gonna show you something cool with the toilet inside. Uh, they upgraded with a, uh, a beautiful toilet. It's like a $600 toilet with LED lights. Low point drain valves for winterizing. They're all in the heated enclosed area. Pretty cool. You had a generator if you wanted a generator that's where they put it on the Newmar Mountaineers uh, this is storage I'll show you see it's full looks like they keep their sewer hose there and it is a heated compartment area you have a 10 gallon gas electric direct spark ignition water heater you do have two 30 pound or I'm sorry two large 40 uh, pound LP tanks more than enough to take care of the the uh, uh, dual furnaces on this. I believe this is going to be your controls for the leveling jacks. You do have front power leveling jacks. More storage up underneath here. Uh, you do have dual batteries on this coach. Kind of back up here, show you the s s color scheme on this. The paint job is just beautiful. Uh, for 2003 model, uh, definitely if a dealer was going to take this in on trade as far as condition on the outside I, I think a dealer would probably put this in their showroom I'll show you let's kind of zoom in on the Mountaineer logo beautiful beautiful fifth wheel try to speed this video up a little bit go ahead and go on inside uh, the owners uh, this is how well the owners took care of this coach they wanted me to take off my shoes before I did my video. I do want to show you this. This is awesome. Uh, you are rarely going to find this. This is the pull-out uh, entry step that they offered on the Mountain Airline. Not sure if that was an option or not, but uh, definitely this is definitely the heaviest duty entry step uh, that I've ever seen on a fifth wheel. And they did upgrade with a lighted handle. Look, you got a little handle here. Isn't it cool? Okay. Inside, this coach is 100% showroom condition. I will show a little spot on the wood back in the back that the owners pointed out. I didn't even notice it, but they pointed it out. Uh, but anyway, this is a beautiful floor plan. This is the rear drop-down entertainment floor plan. Give you an idea of the floor plan here. Okay. I want to go ahead and start in the back because this is awesome. Uh, this is the drop-down living room. Pull back in, drops down, steps down. Basically, you have two entertainment areas on this coach. And they're calling this a, a maple wood finish. Do you have a dual home theater stereo systems? You got you have one here for this TV, and then you have one in the kitchen 
area that I'll show you. It does have the old uh, TVs in, uh, in he the back here, but uh, you can easily upgrade. Uh, it's not, not an issue, but uh, beautiful cabinets. Some of the best cabinetry work you're going to find in a fifth wheel. The cabinets, cabinets on this is the same you'll find in a Newmar Mountaineer $300,000 motorhome in 2003. Nice recessed lighting. Mirrors. More storage. The whole back here is a huge window. And uh, they do have thermal foil on the coach, so on the windows. So, but uh, right here. Uh, I think it's where that window got um, sweated or sweat, um, but anyway, uh, water got in here for a small period of time from that window, and it just uh, it just stained it. That's all. There's no rot. It's just staining in the wood. More storage. You do have a, uh, a fireplace, a space heater. Basically, uh, you do have central vac. I think there's a Dometic central vac, there's a hose, you can pretty much do the whole coach. I will tell you this, uh, the carpet is a showroom condition. All the padding, everything. Uh, this coach inside, it, it looks like the day it was purchased. You do have two rocker recliners. They are flex steel. All your furniture in this coach is flex steel uh, and it's a fabric. Again, all your fabrics, everything, showroom condition. The owners are in the military. They are the original owners. Show you recessed lighting. There's your uh, Sony uh, home theater surround sound speakers. More storage. Day night shades all throughout this coach. Okay. Nice step up there. It's definitely cool. Not sure why they didn't do it on a lot more coaches. Definitely a lot of residential feel. I will tell you this, that's the only ballast that's out. I do point out everything and uh, that ballast, this, I don't know, just stop working. Freestanding table and chairs. Again, all your fabrics are in excellent condition. Kind of zoom in. Show the pattern. Unbelievable how the condition on this camper. Uh, this is your slide out in the living room. It's about, uh, I'm going to say it's about uh, 12 foot long, maybe 14 foot long, and it's uh, 3 foot deep. Out of bed sleeper sofa. Uh, I believe that's an air mattress. I have to check with the owners. But again, all your fabrics are in excellent condition. Day night shades. And uh, this is an upgrade. Owners put in a new uh, light over the table. More recessed lighting, accent lighting. Ceiling fan here. I do want to point out on the ACs, they are upgraded. As I said, uh, this is the, the quietest AC system you're going to get. Most uh, uh, fifth wheels will have uh, the AC mounted, let's say right here, and it will be the return right here, and it will be just really loud when it's when it's on but uh, the AC just turned off and you probably didn't even notice it was on and that's because uh, the returns are all on one side here's your return that's your warm air return the filters on each one and all the vents on the left hand side of the coach are all the returns and all the cold air blowouts here exhaust are all on the right hand side quite a stacy system in the industry and newmar uh, definitely was definitely in 03 were the one of the only ones if not the only ones doing it they do it on all their high-end motorhomes pretty cool i think they're calling that the true comfort ac system 2003 okay here's your second entertainment center area it does have the upgraded tv it's the same sun and this does have home theater surround sound. Show it to you. Home theater, DVD. This thing's fully loaded. You don't need anything. If you if you end up buying this coach, you pretty much don't need to buy anything as far as uh, as far as entertainment wise. And again, beautiful maple finish. Lots of storage space. Okay, your kitchen. Huge kitchen area. Again, lots of cabinet space. All solid wood drawer fronts. 
actually all your uh, styles, everything is solid wood on this. Newmar, again, does the best uh, uh, cabinets in the industry. Uh, Corian countertops. Nice. I'll show you that beveled edge. Beautiful Corian countertops. The kitchen sink was upgraded. Huge double bowl sink. The owners did a lot of upgrades. Definitely upgraded faucetry. Pull out sprayer faucet. Water filtration. Lots of counter space. Even your stovetop cover is is Corian. Uh, usually you'll get like the black metal look, but uh, definitely a lot of residential feel. You do have that three burner gas, gas cooktop. I believe the front one's going to be a high output. Looks to be about a 22 inch oven, largest you'll find in uh, in a fifth wheel. Nice microwave. Huge refrigerator by Dometic. They have this coach pretty much loaded down. Nice pots and pans drawer down there. Nice pantry, huge pantry. Okay, kind of speed this video up here. Again, we've got home theater surround sound, uh, two di different uh, home theater surround sound systems on this coach. All your heat and AC is all ducted all the way through. Here's your thermostat for the control the zones for your AC and your furnace. Nice step up. All your high traffic entryway looks like a tile, but it's actually the linoleum or a vinyl flooring. I've got this light out for a reason. I'm going to show you his bathroom here. As I said, I'm going to try to speed this video up here. There's your toilet. It's a foot flush porcelain toilet. It upgraded from the original. And uh, when you have it open, uh, it does the light and it has even an aerator. Um, and then you have a light here. And it does have a sprayer. Can I give you an idea? Okay. Cabinet there. That's really cool. Uh, fully loaded again. Washer and dryer stackable unit. And then you have more storage there. Beautiful glass enclosed shower. It is a one piece, one piece shower, which is definitely something you can't say a lot. In 2003, uh, they were doing two pieces and you'd have a ugly caulking seam down at the bottom. Uh, the owners, I think they upgraded this with a thing. Kind of shuts off from the skylight. Nice garden tub. Garden shower, I guess is what they're calling it. You can sit down, shave your legs. Nice vanity area. Again, all your carpets in excellent condition. Uh, it's your slide out in the bedroom. It does have the ultra plush uh, mattress. You have storage up underneath there. More storage you can think of. Uh, show you your headboard there. This coach is beautiful, beautiful. Oh, I do want to point out, you do have a little separator for privacy from the bathroom to the bedroom. And another upgraded TV there. Your cable satellite ready in every room. And again, more storage. Okay. Awesome floor plan. Definitely, uh, if you're looking for a nice coach, a clean coach, uh, this is definitely the coach you might want to check out. If you're interested in the camper and you want to come and see it, just call the number on the edge. You deal directly with the owner. If you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you give us a thumbs up on YouTube. And uh, if you want to keep up to date on RVs coming for sale in the Louisville area for sale by owner, you can always follow HelpSellMyRV.com on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and YouTube. Thank you.